Hi ladies, um, I just wanted to do a quick haul video. I went to the Dollar General um, earlier today and I just wanted to show you some of the things I got because I got some really good deals today. It's a really small haul but I thought it was worth it just to show you. Um, aside from the things that I really needed, I'll well, several of the things that I got were on last chance sale, which means on top of already being clearance down, there was an additional 50% off the clearance price on several of the items I got. So, I will let you know when I get to those, but I'm going to start with the toilet paper. I needed the toilet paper. It's actually what I went for. Um, and I have no brand loyalty uh, when it comes to stuff like toilet paper. So I almost always get the store brand whenever I go um, shopping, um, except for Walmart. I don't like Walmart toilet paper, um, but the dollar store brand is actually really good. So I got that. It was only $4.50, so it's a pretty good deal, and it's the double rolls, so I like that even better. Um, let's see. Delia picked out these... Uh, fruit reward stickers. Um, I like that she picked circles this time because last time she picked stars and they're very hard to peel off the paper. Um, there's 400 of them and it was a dollar so it was a pretty good deal. Um, we use reward stickers a lot or at least we did before I got tired of pulling the stars off the paper because they would either rip or fold in half and it was just annoying. Um, let's see. Next I will show you these, uh, these are actually, oh, good, I'm going to fill out, uh, plastic shower curtain hooks that I needed. I wanted metal ones, um, for, um, one of my Pentober, uh, crafts. And it says it was a dollar, but it was one of the last chance items, which means... I can find the price. They were 37 cents after, nope, they were, let's see, they were not 30, yes, they were 37 cents after um, the additional 50% off the clearance price. So, that was a pretty good deal. Um, they only had three things of them left, and the other two were pink, so I got the blue, um, because I need the blue, f I need a non-girly color for what I'm doing. Um, I needed nail polish remover, um, mostly because I'm doing some nail videos for Pintober, and I ran out of nail polish remover the last time I did my nails. So, I got that. It was $1.50. Um, it's better than the bottle that's this big for a dollar, so that's what I do. Uh, let's see. This stuff. Utterly smooth. Um, hand cream or utter cream um, it's really good I love it it's the only stuff I like to do on my hands um, it's just I I really love this stuff I don't know what else to say about it it smells good it's got a really light smell and it was only two dollars and fifty cents so I figured why not I needed some more anyway I've been out for a while and using some other lotion that I don't really like very well so I got that I also was out of face wash, so I got the dollar store brand of my face wash because it works just as well as the Clearasil or any other of the name brands, and it's a lot cheaper. I think it was $3.50. Yeah. Uh, yes, $3.50 for the face wash. Okay. Then these totes, these little totes were on the... Um, last chance table. It's just little, uh, caddies. Here, I'll show you. The one that doesn't have stuff in it. Yep. They're just, a uh, plastic tote caddy. Um, it says they were $1.50, but they were on the last chance table. They were the last two on the last chance table. So, I got each of those for 56 cents after the last chance, uh, reduction. Then, I needed this pencil box. It's got stuff in it. I'm going to show you that stuff last. Um, I needed this pencil box. I was actually going to um, skip getting it because 
I went to get one last time I was at the dollar store and they were out. So I actually switched one of my Pintober ideas for another one uh, because I needed this for the video that I had planned. But they were out, so I just thought I, I would switch. But now that they have them, I'm thinking I might switch back to it because I'm going to use it anyway. So I might as well show the video for it. So we'll see. Um, that was... Hmm. Uh, da -da 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 a dollar so it's not a big deal if I don't end up using it exactly for what I intended but I probably will next we've got oop, I'm gonna open this I needed a single hole punch I have a three ring hole punch um, but I needed a single one and it was only a dollar uh, for this so I went ahead and got that because again I need it for uh, one of my craft projects um, I could have used the three hole punch but it'll just be easier to use the single punch then I got I am slightly obsessed with post-its and tabs and I love these mini post-its because I can use them as really cheap tabs um, and for just teeny tiny notes to put in planners and whatnot. I actually, for my family binder, use um, little tabs, these post-its, as the dividing tabs um, because they I can make them stick out farther than the ones on the tab sheets. Um, so these were the last five uh, packs. I have already opened this one and separated it because I needed to use them earlier. Um, they were the last five. They were on the last chance table, and they were only 18 cents per little cube. So that was a great deal. Um, all together I ended up paying $18.43 after tax and I don't think that's half bad for all the stuff I got especially considering the stuff that was expensive was the stuff that I need on a regular basis anyway. Um, and it's not even really that expensive because if I had gone to Walmart I wouldn't have been able to get this stuff for this price. So I'm pretty happy with it and I just thought I would share it with you. Have a good night, ladies.